Now we are going to see odd and even number. Okay, odd and even numbers. That is, first we must know what is an even number. The numbers that can be put into pairs are even numbers. The numbers that can be put into pairs. For example, in the class, uh, we have select some children for the um, what? Any kind of a competition for a dance competition, or music competition, or debate competition, whatever the competition may be, we have select some children. So we have to uh, make it as a group. So in each group, uh, what? A uh, six students. That means we can uh, what we selected six students as a group means so we have to pair the students so two 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 that means two students as a pair and two students as a pair and two students as a pair that means three pairs come that is called as so that is what they mention the numbers that can be put into a pairs are called as even number that means six children but three pairs coming right that is called as a even numbers for example all the numbers that have 2, 4, 6, 8 and 0 in the ones place are called as even number. That means all the numbers that have 2, 4, 6, 8 and 0 in the ones place. That means you can take any number that ones place this number come. Okay. In the ones place 2, 4, 6, 8 and 0 comes means that is called as a what? even number any kind of a number any number you can take for example 40 in the ones place only you have to see ends with the what zero so it is a even number for example 12 so you have to see that you have to look at the ones digit so the number ends with what two so that is a even number next for example 14 so number ends with you look at the ones digit the number ends with four so it is a even number the next is 16 so the number you look at the ones digit the number ends with what six so it is an even number next is 18 so look at the ones digit you have to see only the ones digit look at the only only you have to see only the ones digit first so what is the number this is eight so if the number so in the ones digit what does the number come in the ones digit eight okay so the number ends with eight that is called as a even number so that is what i tell you so 20 means what is this so you have to look at the what number ones digit place always so ones digit what is the number zero so the number ends with zero so two four six eight zero the numbers ends with whatever the number may be the number ends with especially in ones digit two four six eight zero that number are called as a even number so now we are going to see the odd number the numbers that cannot be put into a pair are odd numbers you understood very clearly if you take a what uh, that means uh, nine children in a group means so you can make you cannot make it as a pair because four pair and the remaining one child is there so two into four you can get what eight the remaining one child in the group so you cannot make into a what pair that is what the numbers that cannot be put into a pairs are odd numbers nine means nine you can consider as a group you can consider as a group that is not a problem but you can't make it into a what pair that is called as that is what the number that cannot be put into a pair or odd numbers example all the numbers that have one three five seven and nine in the ones place that means you must know about it so example 11 so you must look at the ones digit the number ends with one it is a odd number next is 13 so look at the ones digit the number ends with three so it is a odd number next 15 so look at the ones digit the number ends with five it is a odd number 17 so one seven look at the ones digit seven so the number ends with seven so it is a what odd number next 19 so now one nine so look at the ones digit the number ends with nine so it is a odd number so one three five seven and nine so all the numbers that have one three five seven and nine in the ones place otherwise the numbers end with one three five seven and nine these number are called as a odd number the numbers ends with two especially in the ones digit that is called as a what ends with that is a ones digit we can call it as a ends ends digit the ones digit always end always a ends digit we can call it as ones digit means that is the last digit that is the ends digit so the number ends with two four six eight and zero it is an even number the number ends with one three five seven and nine it is called as a odd number 
I think you understand clearly. Look at the videos once or twice. You can understand the concept very clearly and practice more sums also. Now, find out even and odd number. So, look at the number 4444. You have to look at the ones digit. So, the number ends with 4. So, I have told you the number ends with 2, 4, 6, 8 and 0. It is an even number. So, this is called as a even number. Okay. I think so you understand. Even number. Okay. Next is 21. Okay, look at the ones digit. The number ends with 1. That is called as a odd number. I have told you the number ends with what? 1, 3, 5 and 7. It is a odd number. Now, 18, 1, 8. Look at the ones digit. It is 8. So, I have told you the number ends with 2, 4, 6, 8 and 0. It is a what number? Even number. Next was 63, the number ends with what? 3. The number ends with one digit is 3. The number ends with 1, 3, 5, 7 and 9. It is an odd number. 63, 63. The ones place it is what? Ones place is 3. So the number ends with 3. So if the number ends with 1, 3, 5, 7 and 9, it is a what number? Odd number. I think you understand the concept very clearly. Thank you and that's all the place value is place value the chapter 1 is over.